What is happening now? So this is a Tesla Mouse here. Your coach is Houston Rice. This is our week six VPL match. We are taking on Slow Formula, aka Greg of the Chicago Earth Rings. I believe we took him on back in season two. So this is gonna be a, another rematch. So let's get this going. If you guys would like to know why I'm bringing the sets I'm bringing, you guys know the standard drill. Go watch the team building before you watch this match. But we are taking them on, and yeah, as you can see, we're bringing Lando, Victini, Raichu, Skarmory, Venusaur, and Blastoise. So, normal rules. Alright, so we're going to go with Aether Foundation here. Uh, this match has completely no effect on us making playoffs. We're already locked into playoffs. Um... If you guys want to know how that is, well, there's a very interesting, unique w take on the playoffs, and I'll explain that in an informational video before the playoffs start, but for right now, we are battling a slow formula, and we are going to hopefully not suck against him. He has the following mons on his roster. He has Mega Sharpedo, Gullerx, Room Heat, Serena, Clefable, Alakazam, Mantine, Haxorus, Tarakion, and Durin. So, got some threatening stuff on his team. Um, Haxorus is his extra Z-Move user, but because of a mission. However, Z-Move user is not um, taking place until week 7, so he can't really use that on us. And A! A! He has no ground type on his team, so we can just Wolf Switch to our heart's content. Awesome. Alright, anyways. Alright, Sharpedo, Alkazam, Rotom Heat, Clefable, Tarakion, and uh, Mantine. So, here we go. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Good luck, have fun to my opponent. And we're going to start with Raichu. I was actually very worried about the uh, Golurk, too. So, let's get this going on. I think his lead is either going to be Tarakian to set rocks or Rotom Heat. It's going to be one of the two. But I do want a hazard stack in this battle. And he does have a possible hazard remover in Mantine. That will definitely be his hazard removal. Remover. Alright. What is his lead going to be? His lead is going to be as follows. Once again, to the battle. His lead is going to be my cookies, which will be Rotom Heat. And my lead is going to be Houston's own The Ride Shoe. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with a uh, Volt Switch here. So that's a nice volt switch. He's a withdraw, which is interesting. He's gonna go into Lady in Pink. Awesome, awesome choice. So right choice the volt switch. We get switch initiative here, and I'm gonna go into Jungle Fever, the Venusaur. Now he has, he has no good switch-ins to Venusaur, so we, we should be fine here. Yeah, he has no switch-ins to it, so I'm going to just go for the Mega Evolution and I'm going to go for a Sludge Bomb. Now it's quite possible he could Thunder Wave us and that would kind of suck, but we're going to get some major damage off here. Some major damage, man. Major damage. His other has his other Z move users are the ones that he can bring this week are Alakazam, Tarakian, and Durant. He's gonna bring Ray Ray to be Mantine. That is fine. That's fine to me. Let's go for a Sludge Bomb here. We do get a Poison off of the Mantine, which is alright with me. 
Hmm. If we can get rid of the Mantine, let's just set hazards and hazard stack them. I'm gonna go for it right. I'm gonna switch into Raichu here. I'm gonna go for Raichu. You might go for Miracle. Expecting another Sludge Bomb or even a Giga Dream, but we are gonna go into Houston Zone at Lee Raichu. Houston Zone, the Raichu, man. This match was, was supposed to be done two weeks ago, but due to um, things that came up, wasn't unable to do it then. So, yeah. That is why this is a late battle. I'm like making up excuses here. I don't know, I've been having a lot of uh, problems lately getting things done on time because I've been having a lot of interruptions and whatnot, but we're alright. And he's gonna go for the air slash. Nice. All right. Air slash does like no damage to our Raichu. And I believe he is going to switch. If I remember correctly, he's probably gonna switch. So we're gonna go for Volt Switch. We have no reason not to. It's not like he has a ground type on his team this week. We'll draw Ray Ray. He's gonna go into your cookies. I do love some cookies here. Who doesn't? All right, so Volt Switch. Let me go for Blastoise. Ooh, Volt Switch. Hmm. You might be expecting something. Right, let's see. I have an idea here. I'm gonna go for the Miracle. Let's see if he falls for it. Let's test him. Let's test this guy and see if he'll fall for the Miracle. He might be like, oh, no, you got a right shoe. I'm not going to fall for that. I'm not going to go for Volt Switch. I'm not going to go for Volt Switch here. We do have the early lead with the momentum. With um, his man time being poisoned. No, he's not going to fall for it. He's too smart. They didn't pink, that's fine. I'm going to go for Stealth Rocks here. We'll go for Skull. You can switch to a Mantine. Well, it's a risk that we're going to take. It's a risk that we can take here. Just want to see what he wants to do with Clefable. He might switch to Alakazam I'm expecting to switch into Venusaur, so... Skull might not be such a bad idea here. Gold might not be such a bad idea after all. We're gonna go in time, right? Prometheus, it should be. Then I switch. That's a nice switch prediction right there. I might actually go for... Uh, we're gonna go with Victini. I'm gonna double out. I'm gonna double out because I'm out. I'm going to Ray Ray, which is fine with me. The thing is, he has no switch-ins to... Um, he has nothing to be immune to Victini, so I can just go for Bolt Strike if absolutely necessary. Well, the question is, would he switch Vikini out? Would he switch Vikini out? He knows that we could carry Bolt Strike. He knows we could do it. 
He knows. I'm gonna go for you turn in case he switches out. He might go on Rotom Heat. But we know his Rotom Heat is not Choice Scarf. It is Leftovers. Drawn a spy isn't going to Lady in Pink, not bad. Not even bad, man. Going to Jungle Fever of the Venusaur. Book of Fable. It's gonna get heal leftovers. And let's go for another Sludge Bomb. This thing might have a Thunder Wave on us, so we do want to watch out for that. We'll draw Lady in Pink, Michael and Alakazam. Ray Ray, which would be Mantine. Now the question is, is he fast enough? If he's faster, he can go for Roost on the Switch. We'll just go for Giga Drain in case. We'll go for the Giga Drain. Please go for Roost. Oh no, he's um, actually... Sl he's actually slower than us. Alright, so... We know that he's slower than us. That's good. That's good, I suppose. I'm not really sure how good it is, but... It's alright. We could have killed him there with Sludge Bomb, but... I feel like he might have more speed investment than our Venusaur. Alright. It's not too bad. Not too bad if I do say so myself. Then I'll go right you. He might go for the mirror coat. We're gonna go into Houston's own the right you here. Those are roost, that's fine. Alright, so it's Air Slash, Roost, Defog, and probably Miracle. I'm over Volt Switch here. I could have killed him off that Sludge Bomb if I thought, if I, I knew I was faster. I'm gonna switch on Ray Ray, gonna go into. My cookies! No man, they're my cookies. Mine. Let's get that established. They're my cookies. My cookies, man. My cookies. Now that's actually gonna be a sore. He's not choice spec, you know that. So we'll just go for Sludge Bomb or whatever. My cookies, man. My cookies. All right, Sludge Bomb. You could switch into Elkazam, and that'd be all right. Will us? That is fine with me, actually. I don't not mind that one bit. Uh, we're gonna go. Uh, I don't know. What do you. Would he go for a Volt Switch here? I may as well go for Giga Drain. Get some health back. Or maybe Sludge Bomb would be the better play. We'll go for Sludge Bomb. Volt Switch. I could have went for. Um, 
the right to switch in, but I decided just to go for Giga Drain. Or the Sludge Bomb, rather. Let's see what he brings in. He's gonna bring in Ray Ray! Ray! Ray Ray the Mankind! What is up? How are you? It's been a while, you know? Things have been alright. Well, I'm upset that I could have just took out that man time. Not gonna lie, with a sledge bomb a few turns ago. Like a burr. I'll go over Giga Drain here. That damage. Nice special defensive beast. Skull, alright, so he has Skull, Air Slash, he has Skull, Air Slash, um, Roost, and I'm gonna guess Defog here, cause, I'm gonna go for a Sludge Bomb, maybe get like a critical hit off him or something, a critical hit, yeah, I don't think he has Miracle. I don't think he has Miracle at all. He could have Miracle, but that'd be very bad for us. I'm scared, man. I'm scared. Scared of his roster. I'm very scared of it. Sledge Ball, let's see what happens here. Almost takes him out. Alright, we're just, That's fine. If we can just make him waste his roost, then that'd be great. Just make him waste his roost and whatnot. Hmm. I can go for I can go for sense of sets, I guess. I should I might I should probably go for synthesis here, I guess some HP off. I'm gonna go for Giga Dream though, get some health there. Then go with synthesis here because alrighty then. I think this might actually take out the man time. This next sludge bomb. Please be enough health where it does matter. Ah uh, yeah, I think this uh, sludge bomb is gonna kill. This sludge bomb is definitely gonna kill here. They can start hazard stacking on him. Alright, Sludge Bomb should knock out the Mantine. And it does, the Defogger is down. Now we go for the Hazard Stacking, because we are able to. We are able and willing. Alright, so Mantine is dead. A Hazard Stacking is not really going to help us against the um, Alakazam, but should be fine otherwise. So let us Defogger go down. Not really good for him, and I don't want to lose my Venusaur. Ah, Prometheus! Uh, the Alkazam. I want to do some Kelks real quick. See what a Z Shadow Ball does to my Victini. Hopefully it doesn't do a lot, doesn't do too much. Level 50 here. Alakazam, I'll just say, uh, I should guess. 
matters. Z Shovel would actually kill our Victini, and that's not something we want to risk. Or is it? I am going to go for Blastoise. So this stage was really no. If we're going to lose something, we're going to just sack something off here. We may as well. Psychic. Alright. Oh, good damage. Good damage, good damage, good damage, good damage. Alright, damage, I suppose. That did, like, nothing to our Blastoise, however. Which is really cool. I could, I could switch him to, um, Venusaur? Or Victini? I think the play here is to go into Victini. That's what I'm going to do. He's going to try to Prometheus. He is going to go into Lady in Pink, which is fine. And that's a, and we're going to go into Void Gaming the Victini. Alrighty. Victini. I want to see what Victini's V Crate does to Clefable. We'll say, oh, you Magic Guard, I guess. So Victini's V Crate would be a two shot on it. Cool. Let's just hope it doesn't have Thunder Wave. That'd be really bad for us. That'd be very bad, very bad, man. Very bad. Self Rocks will affect the Tarakian. Alright, so he's gonna switch eyes and go into Tarakian. Speaking of the devil. Speaking of the devil that you know. And V Crate does a whopping 40%, 35 to 40% to this Tarakian, which is amazing. I am going to go on Land of T because I don't really want to lose my Victini at this stage. But I am the devil that you do know. Now his Tarakian could be a Z-move user. But we do have a special Heat Land of T set on us this week. There's honestly no reason for us to stay in, so... We got that minus one going. Timmy the Taraki is gonna go for Swords Dance. Nice. Might think that we're a choice scarf. I wanna see uh, minus one was what would um Continental Crush do? What would Continental Crush do to a Taraki at minus uh, plus one rather? Alright, uh, Landers T. We'll just say plus one. It probably would knock us out. Oh, actually, we wouldn't. So we should be fine here. Let's go for the EQ. Alright, Intercontinental Crush, let's go. If these calcs are correct, it will not one-shot us. So, let's hope that we are actually correct. Come on, Lando T. Live. When you're when the Celts are incorrect. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I went, I went my I went plus one 
And it was at minus one, so I don't know why that felt so incorrect there. Whatever. Whatever. Hmm. Still laughing there, though. I want to go for Iron Head, though. You're going to go for the Iron Head. He's got Swords Dance. Use that plus one. The showdown Celts lied to me, man. I'm a little disappointed in this. He lied. Like I said, it's 2.7 to 73.9% damage. Now, I believe it would have told me if it was a crit, right? They're liars. Close comment, that's fine. It's alright with me. That's it, right? And Iron Head is going to take out the Taraki on knife. So Tarakian is down. So you got two down on his side, one down on my side. The Rotom Heat is out. I'm going to Revolt Switch. I'm going to avoid gaming the Victini. Hoping he, goes, he does go for Overheat. To a Volt Switch, which would be the obvious play here. Alright, Volt Switch. That's fine. So I think it's going to go to Sharp Pedophile. The Pedophile at Sharp. I do want to keep my keep my thing as healthy as possible. Let me go for a U-turn here. Oh, let's go for the Mega Evolution right off the bat. So you are kind of forced to do that. This is very unfortunate. You turned as a nice 75%. Yeah, guys, don't don't always trust the Kelks. <laughs> I just learned that the hard way. All right, Crunch Omega Sharpedo so strong. Does take us out. The Skarmory is knocked out. We'll go to Raichu. We don't want to take that our Scarf Bikini yet. We don't want to suspect that we are Scarf Bikini. Although I might just uh, figure it out. We'll just go for Volt Switch here. I don't even know what's up with this nickname either. I don't know what's up with it. <laughs> So we're gonna let, we're gonna let Raichu take out the Sharpedo maybe. 
Maybe, maybe stick your head in gravy? He's going to draw a Sharpedo. Interesting, he wants to keep it alive. He's going to my cookies! Uh, not dude, they're my cookies. I told you that already. Come on. They're my cookies. What are you doing? What are you doing, man? I actually want to run some Kelsier Victini. Uh, Victini. Void Gaming. Versus Rodem Heat. See how much a V Crate does. We'll say, are you a defensive pivot? V Crate would do 28.8 to 36.6 to him. What does uh, Rodem Heat do to Mega Venusaur? Let's put our correct counts here. Bring these Kelks, man. Go Kelking during battle. I think that we're gonna do our best here. Yeah, so our Mega. What does Overheat do? And not a lot of damage. I do still want the um I do still want the Venusaur for the Clefable. I'm gonna go for a scald. He might just uh, Volt Switch and expect a Mirror Cone to stack up Torpedo or something. This is a tough battle. Very tough battle here. Very, 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 very tough battle. Very tough. Come on, stack something off. Losing our lander team is big, and the, I, I'm still a little salty about those Kelks lying to me. You notice that we're packing the Miracle, it's like, like, why are you putting Blastoise in? Going for Volt Switch? Oh, I could have went for Miracle there. Sad day. Maybe he'll stack on the Sharpedo here. He probably doesn't want to stack off his Clefable. So. Uh, Promethea. Alright, that's not too bad. That's alright. I'm going for the Gigavolt. The Gigavolt Havoc here. I'll go for a Skull again. Show ball, that's fine. We could have went for Miracle, we could have just taken him out. It's alright. It's alright. And Alakazam is down due to a skull. Not bad. Alright. There goes his main way to deal with my Venusaur. There goes his main way to deal with it. Here comes the Sharpedo. <laughs> That was just a nonsensical thing. And we really don't need the Blastoise, so we'll just go for Skull. Crush Omega Shape is so strong. I'm gonna go on Raichu here. 
I think this will be a very close battle. I was definitely expecting him not to go for Volt Switch. If he went for... Could have got Miracle off or something. Kill the Alakazam with relative ease. But, you know, it happens. So we'll try to go blocker, 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 blocker. That's what he's gonna do. Alright, we're going. Little bikini here. I'm pretty sure Big T will take will take him out this round. I think Big T's Big Crate should take him out. He might expect a Volt Switch or something. He might switch. He might expect to live. Do I take the risk? I'm gonna take the risk. I don't know. I could run a. What would Overheat from uh, Rotom Heat do to my Raichu? If he's a defensive pivot. And Rotom Heat goes down to a V create. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now the issue is this. The issue is this. He has Sharpedo and he has Clefable left. Fable, he has Sharpedo. I really want the Victini for the um for the Clefable. Hmm. The question is, do I sack it off? Do I sack off the Victini or do I go into Raichu? That is the big question here. I figure out what I should do. I'm thinking really. I think um, U turn from Rachel will kill either way, so. Alright, we'll just go to Raichu. Well, actually, no. We'll stack up the Victini. I just realized that if we do lose our, um, we do lose our Victini, or we don't want to be stuck in a 1v1 situation against Sharpedo. So we're going to go for Raichu. We're going to go for the Volt Switch on the Sharpedo. Great, if he does get Call Mines out, we're kind of in trouble. Alright, so Volt Switch is going to kill off the Sharpedo. I hope that was not a gameplay mistake, but I think what I thought it had to do. Again, if um, we did lose our Raichu, and say we went for our, I don't know. I don't know what I was trying to do there, but we're going to go to Venusaur. I hope that it does not have Call Mine, because that would be awful for us. Very awful. So he has one Mon left, and that would be the Clefable. So this will be a very close to a win if we do or all right let's go for the sludge bomb here oh look at that damage all right call my yeah Venusaur's gonna finish it off here Venusaur is gonna finish off the clefable Alright, we probably thought we were going to go for like synthesis or something, but 
I know synthesis tonight. Alright guys, that is the end of the match. So, uh, good game to my opponent's slow formula. It was a very good battle. A little upset that the damage calcs lied to me about um, Lander C living that plus one continental crush, but what can you do? Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this fantastic draft league match, leave a like, comment, thunder button, subscribe by now. We'll catch you guys on the flip side for some more fantastic draft league action. And remember, keep riding the Thunder Waves to victory. K thinks bye.